Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be talking about sending websites from your computer to your phone and from your phone to the computer by the use of the new features in Android 2.3, which is um, the Chrome to phone feature and the phone to Chrome feature. Well, first of all, I'll be talking about the Chrome to phone feature, which is sending websites from your Chrome browser on your desktop to your phone. It's just, <clears throat> basically, it's a feature of sending links to your phone. So first of all, you will need to have Chrome to phone installed. First, you need to open the app, and it will ask you to link an account, and you would have you will need to add these accounts into your accounts and sync settings under settings in your phone after adding those accounts there you can select an account here I'll check, pick this it will start syncing and it will come to here and tap finish now I'll show you what you have to do on your Chrome browser next you will need to locate yourself to the Chrome web store on your Chrome and you have to click install after installing you will see this thing appearing so let's, and it will ask you to sign in blah 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 you grant access sign in um, this is assuming you are signed in to your Google account because uh, because I have this Gmail thing here, so when I'm signed into a Google account, all extensions are signed into the same account simultaneously. So if you are, so if you do not have this Gmail thing, it should ask you to key in your username and password. So now let's try sending a link to our phone. I will have my phone conveniently placed here and I'll click to send a link you tap you click on this icon here and you say send to phone and you see that and you will hear that there's a notification on my phone and down here at the notification we have the link so I've sent the news of the Galaxy S2 launching in Malaysia next week to my phone and this is how it will appear to open the link you tap on it it will ask you what kind of browser you want to open it in and there we have it now let's try another link This time we will try. This time we will try sending Engadget. Say send to phone, and we have it. Again, we slide this down, and we should see Engadget. So that's sending links from your Chrome browser to your Android phone. Now let's see, take a look at sending links from your phone to your Chrome browser. This is the phone to Chrome app. You will need to download this first, install it. For this feature to work, you need to have a Dropbox account because this works by creating a file in your Dropbox folder and and then updating its details when you want to share a link so whenever you share a link it will update that file 
and that extension in Chrome browser will read that file every time and when it detects a change it will tell you that a new link has been added and that's how you open a new link in the browser so open this, install it so it will ask you to log into your Dropbox account right here and then that's that's the part on the phone now I'll show you the part at the browser so on the Chrome browser you will need to locate yourself to the web store again download the phone to Chrome phone to Google Chrome extension install this it's now installed click on the link it will ask us to log into our Dropbox account Okay, now that I have linked to my Dropbox account, we close this tab. And it <coughs> and it should be linked to my phone already. I've previously used the app before, so there's a counter here. This counter is showing I don't know what. So now let me show you how to share a web page. All right. So you can open any browser that has a share page function. Let's open XDA. Alright, you don't really have to wait for the page to finish loading as long as the link is in the browser. Tap on more, share page. The usual share options will appear. Tap on phone to Chrome. It will say sharing link in background. It should say link shared in a moment. Alright, now we'll look at the desktop. Now that it's shared, we click on this tab it says opening tabs as you can see it's updated to 1 and in a while it should open the website that we've just shared search for something okay so I've searched for Android and my browser is clean as you can see it's a fresh it's a new window open more share page phone to Chrome so it's a sharing link okay the link has been shared Okay, now you see that the icon here on the extension refresh to 1, click on it and there we have it, the search result for Android. So that's it for the video, thanks for watching.